you though, don't it? Yeah. Makes you remember things like like putting a penny on the track. <laughs> Anybody ever put a penny on the track? John, you ever put a penny on the track? Yeah. yeah. Anybody ever put a nickel on the track? No. Oh. <laughs> oh, there's a rich kid put a nickel on the track. Yeah. Boy, I never put no nickel on the track. Let me tell you, when I when I was a little boy. About to old, 10 years old, arithmetic class teacher says to me, she said, Freddie, if you had a nickel in one pocket and then you found a nickel in the other, what would you have? I said, I'd have somebody else's drawers on. Whatever. <laughs> 1863, the Union Pacific Railroad and the Central Pacific Railroad, they started construction of the first transcontinental railroad from Omaha all the way to San Francisco. Now, it was the Central Pacific and the Union Pacific. One started up there in San Francisco, the other started in Omaha, and they just built, kept building until they met. Now, it was authorized by President Abraham Lincoln. And he said, you're both going to get paid the same amount of money. When you meet, you'll get paid. <coughs> well, wasn't going fast enough. So Abraham Lincoln changed the rules. He said, now you're going to get paid for the amount of track that you lay. Then it got to be a fierce contest. All bells let cannons roar in loudest tones of thunder. The iron bars from shore to shore are laid and nations wonder. Through deserts vast and forests deep, through mountains grand and hoary, a path is open for all time, and we behold the glory. Ring out, O bells, let cannons roar in loudest tones of thunder. The iron bars from shore to shore are laid, are laid, are laid, and nations wonder. The great Pacific River. Yeah. Yeah. when they were still out in the boonies. The train came to a sudden grind and stop. She jumped up. She said, what happened, Mr. Conductor? What happened? She said, nothing much, ma'am. We just ran over a cow. She said, well, was it on the track? He said, no, ma'am. We chased it into the line. Yeah, drill, you carry her drill. And we'll work all day till the sugar in your tank will down behind the railway. And drill, you carry her drill. And blast and fire. Johnny Henry was driving on the map. His a hammer was a flashing fire. And the last words I heard that poor boy say, Give me cool drink of water for I die, Lord, Lord. Give me cool drink of water for I die. Oh, that's bun. And he built them up. Cal S. Bunyan, see? All right. And Cal S. Bunyan, he built the most wonderful railroad in this world. That's why he's famous. It's called the Ireland, Jerusalem, Australian, and Southern Michigan Line. <laughs> it took the largest steel mill in this country two years operating on a schedule of a 36-hour day and a nine-day week just to produce one rail for that. Rain is not good. Don't take nothing but the righteous and the holy. Let's pray.